Joining me is Terrace Marshall Jr. outside the LSU locker room. I had a big touchdown in tonight's ball game. You know, obviously every year the LSU Alabama game is uh, you know biggest game on the schedule. How did you guys handle preparing for this one? Uh, we came into it knowing what we had to do, man. And, uh, we just came in with our heads on right, uh, just stayed poised, and just had to get the job done. From last year to this year, how did the, the offense, as far as its confidence and, and expectation going into the game, differ? The confidence improved tremendously. You know, we came, I mean, last year was a blur to me, so I don't really remember how we came in in the game. But I know this year, man, we knew it was ready. We knew we had to do it. Uh, we had went out there and we got the job done. Over 500 yards of offense today, but the impressive thing was you were able to run the football as well as throw a great balance. Uh, how was, you know, you, you, what were you guys able to do today? I was able to do a little bit of everything, man. Shout out to the old line. Shout out to Clyde, the running back. You know, the ones running behind him, man. I'm, they made it happen in the run game. So. When you're out there blocking, I know you don't get a chance to see Claude's moves and all until film, you know, the, couple, the next day. But that spin move, I mean, it's better than the video game, isn't it? Yeah, actually, I did see that spin move. And uh, all I could say was, wow. I mean, he's an elusive player, man. It's, it's fun to watch him play on the field alongside with me. Uh, you're getting a chance to play with history. Joe Burrow setting records you know, every, every game. Uh, in your opinion, did he, did he lock up the Heisman tonight? Uh, in my opinion, he's been locked up the Heisman, but t tonight validates that, and uh, I'm just ready to see what he does for our team going forward. Lastly, what's it like? Take me at the end of the ball game. I mean, you got to hang on for dear life there at the end, but you get to kneel on it, run out the clock. When you know you finally beat Alabama after a, a little drought here the last eight games, what was the emotion like? It was an amazing feeling, but, man, we were so confident in this win. We knew it was going to come out with the victory, so we just had to stay calm the whole time. and. Just let it all out when the clock hits zero. Well, congratulations on a, on a historic night. Yes, sir. Thank all you, right. Jesus. All right. Let's go back to Victor in the studio.